What was very personal for you about writing Lover Enshrined? Well, when I first started, um, the first book came out in September 2005. And I had a three book contract, which was great, and I was really excited to get the first three out. And because I had no idea how they would be welcomed in the marketplace, I've been so overcome by how wonderful the readers have been and how they've gotten behind these books and become enthusiastic about it. So to come to the sixth book um, is really for me. You know, it, it's an interesting personal kind of accomplishment because when I started this, I, I never really was sure I'd get to write more than three of them. And so it just, it was so funny to get to the end of the last sentence in the book and just sort of sit back, you know, and at my computer and really reflect on, oh my gosh, who would have imagined that all this would have happened, that, that you know, these books would have, you know, would have been embraced by so many people and that I would have gotten the privilege of writing as many as I have. Um, you know, and the other thing is, is that Zetas is my favorite hero of the whole series, but but Furious is twin, so it, it's kind of nice for me to, in a way, take a breath and be like, I've done the twins, because you couldn't really do Fury um, without completing his relationship with Zetas, and and Lover Awakened is a, is a big is a big reader favorite, because Zetas is is hands down one of the most tortured heroes that that mo you know that 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 I've ever written. Um, and so it's a wonderful way to bookend and to finish that story because, you know, at the end of the book, you know, you know that Nala arrived in the world safely and Zadis is happy and Fury is happy and the next generation of those two twins, you know, will go out into the world and it's just, it's very personally satisfying and fulfilling to me.